Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some popper slivers, and let's check out our hand here. Well, it's keepable. It's not bad, by any means. So, let's uh, see what we can get done with it. Going up against a uh, small potato. Pretty funny name. Ha ha ha, funny name. It's early. For once, I'm actually recording early in the morning. Pretty crazy. Alright, we got a basic land island. Preordain, huh? So, this could be Delver. We got the Popper Challenge coming up in just a few hours, so we may have some people on the practice uh, just getting ready and doing stuff. Practicing away. We'll do this. I kind of wanted to... I almost should have just put down my sinew. Just to get it down while they're tapped out. If this is Delver, that could be... Hmm, well, Evolving Wilds. Alright, what are you going to grab with that? Draw a card, look at my hand, huh? Alright. I got perfect information. Alright. Oh, well, we're gonna throw this down. Oop. There we go. Hitting him for five. We'll hold on to the steep. Probably be able to cycle that next turn if we don't draw into our forest. Mm -mm. Evolving wilds into what? You want three colors here? No, just another island. Alright. Augur, sure. So this is some kind of Delver. It's a white blue Delver though. Interesting. It's a Zorius, right? Yeah, Zorius Delver, I guess. Well, give me a forest. Ah, that's disappointing. Uh, let's cycle. Try to dig one more deep. There it is. All right, very good. Now we're in it to win it. Perfect cycle. Yeah, block away. By Augur, we bring him to seven. He's got a lot of work this turn. Looks like we'll be rocking into game two in a second. Yep. All right. Sunlance. <clears throat> mm, drop benevolence. Maybe one benevolence. And one sentinel. I don't know if we need anything else from the sideboard. I'm happy with three journeys. Relic? Will Relic be useful? Might be a little bit. But they're playing white. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, so maybe some lance isn't that strong. Maybe we do just want a journey, just in case. Yeah, so let's bring back in... We'll bring back in our Sentinel. We'll just do the four journeys and drop one of the Benevolence. I guess. I don't know. I didn't get a lot of information from their deck other than it looking like a Delver, but then dropping the planes. It's interesting. We can keep this. Uh... We're missing some power, but we've got a Sentinel and a Spinneret. We have a turn one play. We've got a Winding Way. So I'm alright with this. <clears throat> the 
revolvings. We get a journey. It's nice. Probably go grab their island. Straight into the auger. All right. Vines, huh? Oh, that's fun. Let's drop our sentinel, and we'll just pass. Stupid auger of bullets. It's got such a high defense for Popper. Such a great card, though. Gotta love the artwork on this one. This is the War of the Spark artwork. <sighs> Don't worry, I got my, my bang energy to wake me up. To help me get these wins. Okay. That's all they're doing, huh? Uh, well, Benevolent's not bad. We can get some protection up. I would love to Winding Way, though. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I think I am going to Winding Way right now, just try to not get anything counter. I don't know if they're playing with counter spells. We haven't seen it yet, but just never know. But this is great. This is really good. We'll attack in at this point. We'll at least be able to sneak in for one damage, start, start pressuring them a little bit. Why not? Vigilance? Who cares? <clears throat> mm -mm. If we can draw into another forest, that'd be pretty sweet. Be able to drop like predatory into a viverlance. Get some real power, some real poisonous. Pretty happy with our position though. Tireless Tribe. Okay. So, is this just the Tireless Tribe deck, I guess? Well, that's gonna get journeyed. So we may just journey into a Viverlin here. Ooh, we're journeying into a Predatory. Let's start with the journey, though. I don't want Tireless Tribe on the battlefield. No, thank you. You know exactly what I'm coming for. You know exactly what I'm coming for. Yeah, I think we're gonna drop the predatory now. Start really being able to attack into this auger. Slowly but surely. We're getting there. They're a little bit mana screwed, which is unfortunate for them. I'd like to see uh, what else they have going on. They got seven cards in hand. That's where that tireless uh, tribe is going to come in handy. They just discard cards, give them buffs.
I don't think I've ever gone up against a tireless tribe deck actually, so I'm not even entirely sure what the the combo is. Besides just, you know, obviously what he does. Where'd he go? Oh yeah, he's on the <laughs> he's on the battlefield. He's right here. Discard card you know, until end of turn, but do they switch it then? I think they they discard a bunch and then they switch the power and toughness. I believe. Okay. Journey. Who are you targeting? Well, no. I'm not going to have you take that. Yeah. Did you forget about my beloved benevolent bodyguard? There we go. Another journey. It's tempting to just like drop the journey on the auger just so I can swing in for maximum damage, but we won't do that. Uh, I think we're just gonna put another beefy boy on the battlefield that can kill the auger. Poisonous isn't really the route to victory right now at this point. <clears throat> See what they use their mana on this turn. Squadron Hawk. You may search for, for up to three cards in eight soldiers. Okay. So they're going to get some, some birds. Looks like they'll be able to drop one more. <coughs> mm, actually, no, they won't. That comes in tapped. Cool. Always on the defense. Double force would be nice just to like finish this game off real easily. Let's drop our predatory. Now everything becomes an issue. And I am not worried about that squadron hawk, so I'm gonna save the journey for something more important just in case, but this game's pretty much wrapped at this point. We're hitting them for at least seven. Hmm. What are you cracking for here? Can you launch one of my creatures back to my hand? Yeah, what do you got? Possible. Okay, so you're just. <laughs> He's really trying here. He's trying to. This auger has survived the whole game, which is crazy. It's just funny. The strength of auger. The only good Merfolk can pop her. Alright, can you do anything? Gain shadow to the turn. Sure, they just want a card draw. There's not, I don't think there's anything they can really do here at this point. Yeah, sure. They're tapped out. So GG. Yep. Good game. Good game. Some Azorius Tireless Tribe. Never... Uh, Ever got to a chance to combo off, but oh well, it happens. We had a pretty strong board, so hopefully you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned. We've got some. What do we got this week? We've got some Brawlhalla. We've got some more Slivers. We've got the Call of Duty Modern Warfare Beta that's coming up starting Thursday. So expect some live streams and some videos this weekend of that. And yeah, I don't know where opening Sunday, but uh, I guess we'll figure it out. 
later during the week. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like on the video. Subscribe for more slivers. And we will see you in the next video. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no.